So welcome everyone to the Praxis Daily 180 Stress Meditation number 42. Yes, we have reached that magic number, 42, the answer to everything according to the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, for those of us that remember it. And I'm informing you now that I'm changing my schedule. I had made a commitment at the, site, at the start of the COVID lockdown that I would offer a daily meditation for the full 12 week period of lockdown. And I've realized as I've reached this halfway point of 40, it would have been 84 meditations in total. I've reached 42 and realized that in order to preserve my self care and my well being, that I need to pace things out. And also as my work in terms of therapy and offering um, trauma support to many people on the front line, um, the impact is huge. It has an impact on obviously my clients, but also on me. And the whole point of these meditations was about looking after self and, and that includes me too. So what I have decided on reflection is that I'm gonna stand back and offer a weekly meditation for the next 42. And I will upload these weekly meditations on a Sunday, the start of the week, and they will be usable for any day of the week. It's not specific to a particular day. That's up to you how you practice. You also have 41 meditations to work with. You have a whole library that's led up to this point. And I'm going to invite us in this number 42 meditation to come back to here, to the heart. Because this is where it began. We're at the halfway point and it will continue. So 41 to go after this on a weekly basis. So I'm going to invite you to come and join me in the heart meditation. So I'm going to invite you to come and sit comfortably, either on the floor, in a chair, sitting against the wall maybe, wherever is comfortable for you. And come and place your hands on your heart. So you and I can connect and with all the others who are tuning into this meditation as well. And as you close your eyes, allow yourself to settle, allow your body to settle into this safe space. And take this moment as you settle to stop, to really stop and pause, to come into the present. And I'm going to invite you to start with your feet and notice your feet touching the floor. And then noticing your legs, noticing your pelvis, the whole of your back, the whole of your front, your arms and your hands, your neck and your head. And take a moment to notice this body that you occupy. And then I want you to notice your breathing. The flow of the breath coming in and the flow of the breath exiting. The flow of the breath coming in, the flow of the breath exiting. And just noticing that ebb and flow, the ebb and flow. Lovely, and just let it be at its own natural pace. And then noticing your senses, noticing what you can smell right now, noticing what you can taste in this moment, noticing what you can see behind your closed eyes, noticing what you can hear, and noticing what you're feeling through your skin. And turn the volume down on all of those senses enough to still hear me and connect in with me. As I invite you now to draw awareness to your heart, just resting your awareness gently on a beautiful soft cushion that sits within the heart space and rest your weary head and body in this space. And I say weary in the sense of this is a safe space to replenish to recoup, recover, recenter, literally, through our connection and all the others who are connecting in as well. 
and just noticing your heartbeat, your heart beating. And then tuning in to the colour pink, a really appropriate pink that your intuition will be offering to you that's the right resonance, the right frequency of pink and place it in the heart space. And the next time you breathe in, let your in-breath feed that pink light. So as you breathe in, breathing into the heart space, and as you breathe out, let it expand. Breathing in to feed the pink, and as you breathe out, let it expand. Breathing in, bring it back. Breathing out, let the pink light expand. Next time you breathe into the heart, breathing out, let the pink energy fill your thoracic cavity. Breathing in, fill it. Breathing out, expand the light into your abdominal cavity. And again, as you breathe in, draw the light and the breath in. And as you breathe out, let the pink energy fill your pelvis and your legs into your feet. Breathing into the heart, let the energy rise upwards into the neck and the head. And then finally, breathing into the heart, let the energy expanding to the arms and the hands. You are now a vessel of pink heart energy. It is a beautiful energy of love. And let it be the purest love that you know is there. And just hold that for the next 10, 20 seconds in silence. And then holding that field of love, that pink field of love, simply know you can return to this space whenever you need to. So keep using this meditation to recoup, recover, reconnect, recenter, really feel the sense of connection and at the same time being bathed in this beautiful energy at a very, very trying time at present. But this is how we learn to manage uncertainty one of the ways anyway so let that image go feel that your body has been replenished and know that your breathing is always there to keep feeding and then taking away the waste feeding taking away the waste we are constantly moving energy that's the key with awareness even better so i'm going to invite you now to bring your hands together into namaste as you and i draw closure to this practice with three rounds of om shanti so when you're ready Om Shanti, Om Shanti, Om Shanti, peace be with you, take good care, lots of love, keep well, and I will see you in a week's time. Om Shanti, bye bye.